Happy New Year, DR. I'm Jack McGuirk. And I'm Evan Cardozo. And, and welcome, welcome to, to DR Wars. News. To start our news, here is Grant and Trenton with this week's student interviews. Evan, what is your New Year's resolution? Uh, something better than 2015. Hey DR, I'm Trent Sleba. And I'm Grant and Claygraph. And this week we went around asking students what their New Year's resolution is. What's your New Year's resolution? Um, to take shorter showers because I waste too much water and to be more confident. Uh, to be a better person. Get a girlfriend. To grow. Is to play as much Fallout 4 with the boys as possible. You know who you are. To be a DR News interviewer. Your wish is granted. Well, Seth, thank you very much for asking. My New Year's resolution is not to get on this all the time. I'm already a pretty good person. I don't need to change anything. That's all the time we have for this week, DR. Once again, I'm Trent Sleva, signing off. Hello, everybody. Special announcement. I am Tom Kimmel here to tell you that a winter ball will be Friday, February 5th from 6.30 to 10.30 p.m. at the Venus de Milo in Swansea. Tickets are $25, payable in cash or by check, made out to DRRHS, and they will be on sale at all lunches or with Miss Payne in guidance from Tuesday, January 26th through Friday, January 29th. All guests from other schools must submit a guest contract. You must have the guest contract signed before you purchase tickets. If you have any questions, please contact the 2016 class advisors, Mrs. Payne, or Miss Udell in PE. Once again, I'm Tom Kimball, signing off. Next up, for the first time this year, we have Talents of DR with Joe. Hey DR, here is this year's first Talents of DR segment featuring guitarist Cole Moorhead. Have a great weekend, DR. Joe Marcial signing off. Next up is Jack and Andrew with Star Wars trivia questions. Hey, DR. Andrew and I went out and asked these Star Wars related questions. The jump to light speed is ready. Go for it. Who is Luke Skywalker's dad? Darth Vader. Dude, that's really complicated, that one. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Who is the captain of the Millennium Falcon? Han Solo. The assistance of Obi-Wan Kenobi or some crap, because like... <laughs> yeah. I was trying to think of like the whole message. Andrew, that is right. Spoiler alert. <laughs> <laughs> Who is the captain of the droid army? Jimmy Casey. <laughs> Chancellor Palpatine. Incorrect. <laughs> Looks like DR has some Star Wars knowledge. Andrew and Jack signing off. Now back to the studio. Hello, DR. I'm Casey Haskins. Come visit the school store located at the crossroads in room 219. Pick up a bracelet for only $4. You can pick up a pencil for a dollar, or you can purchase a water or Powerade. You can grab a pack of gum, or you can pick up a stress ball for $2. This week's Teacher Highlight featured the man, the myth, the legend, Jedi Master Antani. 
Hey there you are, Darren here, and I'm here with... Mr. Anti- Darren, I know my name, I can introduce myself. If there was one person in the Star Wars galaxy who you could be, who would you be? Uh, I think Princess Leia, for a couple reasons. One, very in touch with my feminine side, but also, she's got the best hair of the whole series. Maybe other than Chewie, so I'm going with hair. I'm taking hair every day of the week. If you were in a Star Wars movie, what would your famous quote be? Uh, my famous quote would be... Do you see this bracelet? Only because I wanted you to. Hmm. So what are your thoughts on a new Star Wars movie? Uh, I thought that it was nostalgic, which for some people can be good and bad. Uh, to me, it was a good thing. Uh, I would highly recommend it. Uh, this, this Star Wars movie, it's a small art house production. It really needs your support. I predict the box office I'm thinking it might make a million dollars this weekend. Guys, you know, small artists, please support. Next up are the High Five Club recipients for the last two weeks. Hey DR, Grandin and Trenton here bringing you the last two weeks of High Five Club recipients. Julia Gervais is enrolled in college, honors, and AP classes. A member of NHS, varsity volleyball, basketball, softball, and best buddies. Julia plans to attend a four-year college to pursue a career in psychology. Nick Kineski is enrolled in many AP and honors courses. A member of NHS and varsity basketball captain. He is an SCC Sun Chronicle and Tongue Gazette All-Star. Nick plans to attend a four-year college to pursue a career in marketing. Jordan Flanagan is enrolled in a mix of AP and honors classes. A member of NHS and Best Buddies, she volunteers as an assistant soccer coach for Dyke Rehoboth Strikers, works as a crew member, soccer referee, and a cashier at Chipotle. Matt Andrade is enrolled in many AP and honors courses, vice president of NHS, member of the basketball and baseball teams, works as a dishwasher at the Harvest Market. Matt plans to attend a four-year college to pursue a career in engineering. Make sure you give them a high five when you see them. I'm Trent Sleva here with Grandin Claygriff. Now back to the studio. Well, the news is already over, but uh, it's been a while, but it's back. Here's a variety show with Sam and Ben. Hello, DR. Sam Nacosta here with everybody's favorite. It's me, Ben. So Ben has not seen a single Star Wars movie, and so I'm here to ask him questions about the series as a whole. Who is this character? That is Luke Skywalker. Not Luke Skywalker. That's Anakin Skywalker. There you go. That's, That's who, it who it is. So who is Anakin Skywalker, really? One of the most iconic characters from the whole series. Yoda! No! Uh... Who's Darth Vader the father of? Luke Skywalker. And who else? Anakin Skywalker. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's Boba Fett. Yeah, you got it. All right, do you know who Boba Fett's son is? Uh, little Fett. No. <laughs> Feta cheese. Uh, correct. Uh, Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> I didn't even ask the question yet. Who are these guys? The Teddy Bear Clan. No. That is Teddy Roosevelt and the boys. Uh, who owns the ship? It's me. Like... All right. <laughs> and who uh, who owns these these kinds of ships, Ben? Yoda. That, that is a moon. That is a that is a life-size recreation of Mike Wazowski from Monsters Inc. <laughs> Who's Anakin's wife? Princess Daisy. I mean Leia. No! Okay, do you know what Luke and Anakin's home planet is? George Lucas planet. You didn't even let me finish the question. I said, do you know what George Lucas's home planet is? George Lucas's home planet is Earth. I can confirm this. Hey Ben, I think you should go watch a Star Wars movie. I do too. That's all we have for you this week, DR. I'm Sam DaCosta. And I'm a doofus. Named Ben Brown. Until next time. Well, the first episode of 2016 is in the books. So until next time, I'm Jack McGuire. And I'm Evan Cardoza. Thanks for watching DR News.